Claire is very straight-laced. She comes from a good, well-respected family. She does well in school. She never really steps out of the boundaries. It's just this one night, she feels the peer pressure from her friend group and gets led a bit astray and ends up taking a drink and it doesn't end well. Burns, he is your uh, typical lad. Lad, he's, uh, he's your guy from the council estate. That's, he's, you know, he's a nut job. He's real, real crazy. Everybody likes him. He's got that charm to him, but there's something real bad about him at the same time. I think everybody needs a friend like Burnsy. <laughs> oh, I get nervous. She has problems with her family and stuff and she sort of is able to let loose in front of her friends but sort of keeps a guard up as well. A player like this in the waterfront reaching to so many people and it's about such a serious issue that I think we're going to raise awareness to young people that this does happen and I mean it was a bit of a reality check for me. Jess is really bubbly and fun uh, but she's really easily led. I play the part of Reese. he is the cool kid but he knows when to draw the line and in this scene where it all happens he didn't draw the line and it goes downhill from there. It's nice to get to work along with Pamela and such a, such a talented cast. The first time Pamela showed me the music, he gave me the chills, Whew, it's, it's big. It's original music by Mark Dockery. It's a really eerie feeling and you can't compare it to anything else. It's just out there. <laughs> like the hum at the start and it just makes you shiver. We're at that age where we have those kind of experiences or have had those kind of experiences, but it's important that other young people see young people performing it. It's been really fun. I've I hated missing any rehearsals because every single one's just hilarious. I think people should come see this show because it's filled with laughter, it's filled with a, it, it, it makes you feel good, but then it also gives you a, a sense of reality to it too, that life isn't always, as they say, sunshine and rainbows, and there is a reality to it, and it's, it's tough, and it, it really, it speaks the truth, you know? It's not your typical musical show, jazz, hands, singing and dancing. It's a bit different from that, you know? The thing that happens at the end of the show, it's really, it will shock the audience and I think it's, it's going to open people's eyes a bit more.